Hey there, guys. So, um, yeah, improving on the grip exercise and, you know, forearm exercises as well. Keeping it simple, um, nothing complicated. So last time, hit five reps. Now I'm at seven each hand. Um, and that was sort of after pull-ups the day before as well. So, you know, forearms are already a little bit taxed. Um, I want to work this up to 20 reps, as I said. It's just going to give me so much extra strength on the arm bench press in terms of stability under load. Um, and it takes away any, you know, wrist or forearm, you know, potential strength issues. Um, and, you know, having everything more stable is just going to lead to a cleaner lift. So a lot of people just, you know, overcomplicate, you know, training of the forearms. You know, it's just pick something simple. You know, you might use a smaller axe. You might use a lighter sledgehammer, um, whatever you can find. But, you know, at the end of the day, this is a functional exercise as well. There's not too many times in life where you're going to have to use like those heavy grippers and really crush in with your hands versus a lot of, you know, things you do, you're just holding on to, you know, objects or tools. Um, so the strength, you know, that you get from this is just practical. It carries across, you know, if you're a landscaper, um, you know, and you're digging, you know, channels or any of the trenches, um, if you're, you know, splitting wood as well, you know, anything where you're gripping and holding, um, an implement is just going to carry across and at the end of the day you know if you can make life more comfortable for yourself you know that's a win um and you know this is just a very simple you know training tool T takes hardly any time the only warm-ups that i do is a few sets of um dumbbell curls i just did a set of 10 each arm gave it you know two three minutes and then i went in and started doing some of these um exercises so yeah you know getting stronger it doesn't take long um, and the hardest part for a lot of people is just starting. So if you need to move your hand further up, you know, the axe as well, then do it. You know, you might make a few markings so that you have a reference points and point and work your way down. But, um, yeah, very easy exercise, very practical exercise and, you know, works really well. So just my take.